Guys, how are we doing today? It is Steve back again for an unboxing of something you may or you may not have ever seen. So today, following on from last week from the Alien Gold ticket for the Nostrarama spaceship, I have a Jaws 24 karat gold plated Amity Island 50th annual regatta. What does that mean? We don't know. So... Here's the back of the box, limited to 1,975 World World, individually numbered, embossed metal ticket and display stand included. 1975 is obviously the year the film was released and it paved the way for summer blockbuster. So I'm excited about this. I do have some reservations already, but I won't go into that at the moment. I will go into it once I've got it all open. And we can have a little goosey gander. So let's get it done. And there we have it. Opened, well, the seal is off. We haven't got into it yet. But you can see already that picture of that woman on the beach loving life. Let's get the box open. And there we have it. So, this ticket is for a full entry. My number is 0685. It's a full entry, ticket three. Do not swim. Beware of sharks. Parking pass from Sheriff Brody's office. Amit one. Now, first impressions is, so that picture you can see, Amity Island welcomes you. Now, in the film, the uh, poster on the background where the sheriff and the mayor talk about the vandalism done to the ticket. Now, the mayor wasn't happy about that. He didn't like it. He was obviously afraid it would steer away, you know, tourism. So what I don't like straight away is the fact that they used that graffiti, put the shark in, put the woman saying help, uh, scared of the shark, because you wouldn't do that, would you? You'd want people to come to Amity Island. So I'm not sure I agree. I would have preferred it if they just stuck with the original poster that they had so yes i like it and but could it have been better i think it could have been let's take it out so it's a lot thinner to the um the whaling ticket but it does feel heavier for some reason um that's nice i like that I like the fact it has the the jaws. In fact, you could probably just <laughs> you could probably just have that as a display on its own without the front. Um, Universal City Studios. So the ticket though is done really nicely done. I mean, it copies that stupid poster. You could almost say here's a theory. You could almost say that the ticket was normal and then someone's gone in and then it shows someone that's graffitied it so what we're gonna do guys i'm gonna turn off the flash let's see if we can read this so it's a lot better actually when you take the flash off so help shark amity and our island welcomes you the 50th annual regatta july 4th to july 10th uh, do not swim alone. Be aware of the shark. Parking pass from Sheriff Brody's office. Full ticket entry. Amit 1. Date 4th attempt 1975. So, yeah, it's nicer without the flash on, to be honest, because you can really see the ticket, understand it more. But obviously, when you have light bouncing off it, it does look good. And again, that's the back. 
really nice actually. Um, but yeah, that's my theory. I think this ticket was normal, but then someone went in and altered the woman's face, helped shark, shark drawn in. That's what I think anyway. But let's get the stand out because we love the stand. I love the stand by Stephen King. Like before, it, it comes with um, these two metal pieces that just fit and slot perfectly. And there we go. So what do you think of that game, guys? Short review. Ticket to go see Jaws. If you're lucky, you can get eaten by him. But the gist of it is, it's a ticket for Amity Island to the beach. And I like the shape of this one. If you compare it to the ticket of the Wayland, it feels more industrial, this does. Whereas this one, it feels like almost like a cinema ticket. So there is a difference to it. They're not just mass produced at the same size. Uh, maybe the same length. That is my thoughts behind the ticket for Jaws. As I said, I think it would have been nicer if they just used the original artwork on the poster without the woman being graffitied on. I know what they're trying to do. They're obviously trying to pay homage to the hysteria uh, to the movie, but I would prefer it to be nice and neat. Um, and we kind of made our own minds up if we wanted it that way. So tune in soon. I've got another Jaws uh, limited edition coin I'm going to review. That should not take long, but keep an eye out for that one. Anywho, thanks guys. Hope you enjoyed the review. Let me know what you think and keep subscribing and keep on liking because I love doing these. I enjoy it and I'll keep doing it if you just keep showing your activity because that's all I do it for. The love of movies. See you guys. Bye bye.